Hi guys, welcome back to this 2300 Gaming again, bring another Pokemon TCG Pocket. If you're enjoying the content in this channel, please do consider subscribing. I'm trying my best to make lots of videos for you guys to get you entertained. I'm making shorts as well, so I'm doing my alt account and my main account pulls. I hope you enjoyed it. Like the edits, uh, it takes me a while to like edit that mi one minute video. So if you are having fun with the content on the videos and the shorts, please do consider subscribing. We're going to be talking about again... The Genetic Apex Emblem Event 1. Okay, why is it 1? Because there's part 2 coming in. Okay, currently I'm 45 wins. Uh, I have a plethora of decks that I have, which I do really love because I'm opening booster packs. I'm not opening it with like 10, 10 and then move forward. I just open it when I see it. But my alts, I do it like on a 10 pull basis. So that's why I, I like to have an alt account to do my, uh, my 10 pull itch. Okay. But on my main, I just do it as I go. So, once we go to the information here in the guide, e Emblem Events, wherein you can battle against each uh, other players. On the second part, there are several kinds of Emblem Events, such as those where you aim to get a certain number of victories, aim for consecutive victories, and more. You can check what kind of event is underway by checking the announcement from the events. Currently, there's still none, but I've seen some, you know, data mines hovering around on what's going on so the event would be most likely uh, again how many consecutive wins do you need to do and thankfully it's not that much but again there's gonna be a plethora of pikachu ex moving forward there so i'm gonna show you um where's my image so plus 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 there's gonna be new promotions as well we had that lapras event so moving forward in the future we might be ha seeing this okay we might be seeing this this again circulating all around i just want to put your put you on notice so this would be so let's just make it smaller here so this would be the possible promo packs that we're gonna be getting okay so there's gonna be a greninja there uh there's gonna be an onyx a jiggly so, like a hunter and a Venusaur. Not, not a Venusaur. Is it a Venusaur? Oh my god, if it's a Venusaur, that's crazy. If it's a Venusaur, that's crazy. So, I can't really see this one. I thought it's like a Bulbasaur. So, it's a Venusaur. So, it might be this one circulating around. So, take it with a grain of salt, okay? So, just if you are looking for that, it's not an EX. Venusaur, it's it's a Venusaur, but still a Venusaur nonetheless. Plus, it's a good card art as well. So this is our the thing circulating around there. And if you're looking for a Greninja deck as well, together with your Jigglypuff, like the sleeping sleeping Greninja deck, you can do that one as well. Or if you want a Brock Onyx deck, or you want like looking for a Gengar deck, this is gonna be an epic promo period. If you're we're gonna be getting this, this is the the first one. The, that's what we're seeing so this would be your second one um we got the meowth event and chancy event now we're gonna be having this one as well we might be having bulbasaur and magnemite so the only thing that you're gonna be looking out is you know ivysaur and you already have a very free to play uh green deck the plant deck because you already have a venusaur there as a promo just like what we have in the lapras ex so if ever this would come out Okay, so you, you can plan ahead or again, take it with a grain of salt. We're not quite sure yet if it's going to be coming out, but this is what's circulating around. And then again, with this one, it's like win five battles continuously. So it's going to be looking kind of rough. It's like <laughs> there's going to be lots of Pikachu decks, that's for sure. But if you have a monkey deck, problem is if you, you put, you meet, you meet uh, a psychic deck, but like still, 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 it's okay. I think uh, lots, lots of Pikachu's will be hovering around the, this one, just trying to get your five wins in. Thankfully, I have a Pikachu deck. It's not great, but at least I have two Pikachu EX. Even if you don't have a Zapdos, or you, like, even if you don't have a Zapdos, as long as you have two Pikachu EX, you're able to like push to make an electric deck using only Pikachu and Voltorb or Electrode or whatever or Electro Buzz with like lieutenant search or depends on you on a raichu deck as well it's all depends on you you just need to be quick but that's just what is rumored circling around the internet right now just giving you a heads up so again take it with a grain of salt but it looks really interesting five consecutive wins 
and then we get like Greninja, and then we get like, uh, my god, we get Bulbasaur as a promo, like the Chansey Meowth event, and then we get a Venusaur as a prize in the promo. That's crazy, just like the Lapras EX, because again, Lapras EX is fairly good, especially when you're like a new player moving forward. So, those are the decks that are giving. Uh, I'm really excited. I'm really excited for this game. I thought that the first event with the Lapras, they, they cannot top this that one up. But like this one looks really good as well. Again, what do you think about the circulating news over around uh, the pulse of what's going on in Pokemon TCG Pocket? I would like to hear from you guys. That's just what's circulating around. So I just want to put it in. Take it at the, with a grain of salt. It's not final yet, but like I'm getting excited with this. So please comment down below. I would like to hear from you guys. This is again 2300 Gaming, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out. Bye bye.